Welcome to Java Forum. Now I am going to show you how to install LLVM 17 compiler on Ubuntu 23.10 operating system. So first I am going to uh, Ubuntu 23.10 repository online. So under that you can go to development. So I am searching for the packages, LLVM 17 packages. Okay, see here, uh, default version is 16, okay. So, LLVM 17 is the higher version, okay. CLang 17, that is, LLVM 17 is available, but it's a higher version. So, default version is uh, 16, but we are going to install the higher version, which is 17, okay. Now, go to the terminal, login as a root user. So, update the repository. So, run this command, apt install clang-17, clang-format-17, clang-tidy-17, clang-tools-17, clang-d-17. So, this will install LLVM 17 compiler and its tools. So, these are the new packages and additional packages to be installed. If you are okay with that, uh, press yes, okay. So make sure that you have fast uh, internet connection so that uh, packages will be downloaded fast. Okay, download complete. Now installation is started. Yes, so LLVM 17, that is CLang LLVM 17 compiler uh, is installed uh, successfully on Ubuntu 20.10 operating system. Okay, now let me show you one thing, CLang iPhone version. See here, CLang not found, which means that this CLang command points to default version, not the higher version. So I already told that CLang 17 is the higher version, okay. So clang-17 is the command we need to use, okay? clang-17 is the command we need to use. clang-17 version and clang++-17 version. So this is the way we need to run clang-17 commands. Okay, now I am executing as a root user. Now I am going to show you uh, how to compile and run uh, C and C++ program. So first I am opening the text editor. I am going to type a C program. So this is my C program. Okay, it's using stdio.h library and it will print the welcome message. So save the file as welcome.c. Okay, now let us compile and run this C file. C line hyphen 17. Welcome dot C hyphen O welcome. Welcome is output file. Yes, output file is created. Now let me run the output file dot slash welcome. Yes, I can able to run the C program successfully using LLVM 17. Okay, now let me show the C++ program. So this is my C++ program. I am saving the file as hello.cpp. So it's using iostream library and it, it will print the welcome message. Okay. First, I am giving the permission. Okay, now I am going to compile and run C++ file using LLVM 17 compiler. Hello dot sorry hello dot cpp iPhone oh hello yes. 
So I can able to run the C++ program also using LLVM 17 compiler. Okay, now I am going to show you very very important thing. Okay, now I am going to compile the file with hyphen H option. First I am compiling the C file with hyphen H option. So this hyphen H option will show you what are the header files used by this file and what are the header files loaded in the memory stack. Okay, so these are the header files used by the single program welcome.c. Now let me show you for the C++ what are the header files loaded. Yes, see here, this much of header files are used by C++ program. So this command will be useful for you if you don't know where are the header files are located, okay. So beginners will face some header files related issue. This can be resolved by using this hyphen H command. Okay, let me show you the USR include directory. Okay, this is the USR include directory. Uh, so these are the header file used by C programs and for C++ separate directory is there. And also you can see that LLVM 17 has separate directory. Okay. So C++ 13 uh, is the compiler version used by LLVM 17. So finally we have installed uh, LLVM 17 on Ubuntu 20.10.